Hola! What up, y'all? Welcome back to Brews with Beck. I'm Dan. How the hell are you? I'm, uh... I'm good. I'm good. Thanks. I really appreciate it. Um, anyway, uh, got this beer from courtesy of Trader Joe's. Very good value. Um, you can get a four-pack of this for literally 12 bucks. Uh, I saw that it got reasonable ratings from, uh, Untapped when I bought it, so I was pretty stoked. This is Made West Brewing out of uh, Ventura, California, I believe. Let me double check. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Ventura, California. Because I've been to their one of their tasting rooms up right off the ocean. Um, this is their sixth anniversary double IPA. This one is 8% on the Richter. Deuce. Double. Um what it says about this, which I don't believe it said on the can what um, hops it is. It says hazy double IPA with strata, citra, Eldorado, super juicy uh, citrus character, followed by stone fruit, notes of nectarine, peach, hints of sweetness, and smooth finish. Um, and, you know, it's about su sums it up. The Eldorado, citra, and uh, I believe strata is supposed to be the passion fruit meets uh, marijuana. Uh, so, yeah, there you go. Uh... I think this is about three weeks in the can, so pretty fresh, and uh, that's about it. Like Made West's uh, regular hazy, like some of the other collaborations they've done. So let's get to it. What up, MVP? What up, Bronx? You betcha nuggets and buffaloes. Let's go. All right. Will you do me that usual solid favor? Please crush the subscribe button and crush the like button. Really appreciate you. That way you can come sit down with a beer with me all the time all right all right all right like and subscribe gracias y'all all right nice nice looking beer there good looking um by the way yeah there's the uh narwhal and then there's that so there it is all right let's get a uh Sniffed a aroma check. Dry hop and, uh, you know, subtle citrus. So, not going to get too crazy with it. All right. No or just emotions should be your MVP again this year. All right, let's go. Nice. I um, feel like I get... They don't say it in here, but when you get... It's debating with uh, my... My buddy Pete, as far as sometimes they don't always tell you on these New England IPAs whether they put wheat, oats. I figure they do because when it thickens it out like this, it's got there's, they've got to be putting some in there, but they don't always reference that. They, now, if it has lactose, they, a lot of times they they have to tell you that. So I'm guessing this one has either oats or you know raw oats or raw wheat or something like that. Because I'm getting kind of that nice bready oats or wheat to go along with uh, a little bit of dry hop and citrus. Um, I do see the, the peach part they're talking about. That's probably coming a little bit from, uh, I guess, citra. Because uh, I think Eldorado is supposed to be more like lemon lime. But um, anyway, yeah, nice bready uh, citrus peach uh, subtle dry hop. Ever so slight, ever so slight, uh, like herbal lupulin powder kind of feel to it. But very good. Um, if I didn't know what this was, if this was a mystery beer, mm -hmm. would I think it was 8%? Uh, yeah. I'd I was going to say, there's just enough umph, a little bit of heat on the back. Not a lot, but enough that you know it's a double. Where I probably would have said about eight. So, not being cocky, but I probably would have guessed eight on this. It's pretty good about getting some of the percentages right out of the mystery beers. Anyway, yeah, good. Breaded note with all those other things. Uh, let me pour the rest in. Get any kind of sediment in there. Cheers, y'all. Hopefully you guys are having a phenomenal day or evening. 
whatever, whenever you're watching this. Yeah, creamy, bready, um, dry hop, peach, citrus, you know, yeah, it's good. I like it. Um, all right, but what this comes down to as far as rating, uh, let me take one more sip. Really, I mean, especially for $3 a can, this phenomenal value for $3 a can. I think I, when I found that out, I, I've already bought in three, four packs and I, because I bought two, two straight up and then I tasted one and I realized I should buy more for the price. Okay. So from stellar down to hell no. Um, yeah, this one is made West solid Ventura beach solid. Um, basically I would give this, it's, it's not like, like amazing, but it is, it is an A beer. I would give it a 94 out of a hundred. Um, it, you know, dips into the A range and it's, for value, it's amazing. Cause again, you know, $3 a can for something like this, man, see if you can find this and just have, it's just kind of like your one. You can all, you can have once a day, once every other day. Cause you know, you don't, you don't always find them for, for, for this cheap. Uh, so well, well done on the price made West. Um, all right. That's about it. I found it at Trader Joe's. I'm sure you can find it multiple places, but, uh, that's all I got. Uh, we'll see you in the next review and, uh, go Denver, go Colorado. Enjoy your cold beverages. Peace.